Stone Calendar is not bad here. Good against Sentries and Laga Villain and Slime Boss. I don't know why I always think about Stone Calendar when I'm looking at random rare relic. I think it's like it's one of the ones that changes in value a ton based on what's happening. Alright. Well, that doesn't help. I do have a shop to buy potions. You're the Rasho man. Need a shop to buy potions. Look at me, my heart of iron. Infernal blade with a uh, Girdia, maybe. Let me just rampage to make sure I beat Lag of Villain. That's correct, present method, yeah. That's how it works. Shop's got some decent stuff in it. I don't think I'm buying card remove here and here. So given that I like want to strike in my deck for the elite fight anyway, it doesn't feel like there's a reason to buy a card remove right now. Maybe this is a spot weakness sort of situation. Okay. I'll believe it. Let's find a Reaper. This just takes a bunch of extra damage for no reason. Unless I draw exactly defend, 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 defend a spot weakness next turn. In which case I needed to play it to not die. I started. The game was thinking about it. I'm back to having no potions. Almost tricks decent. Really, nothing so the six months or anything so before fourteen months. Did I say that already? I don't know. I don't know. I'm on a seven streak right now, rotating. Nope. Intro. 
også, dreng. Nu tager vi en fra. It's likely to give me a potion. Maybe I was meant to buy combust. I think I'm okay. It has an infinite mode, it has endless mode, which is, yeah, that sort of idea. At the end of the run, you just go back to the start of the next run, and all the enemies have bigger numbers. Good evening, Zhang Zhang. Hello. Lost with back one feed. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Not a difficult thing to achieve. gotta do me like that. I think I like corruption here. Would have loved a potion. Dark Embrace might be slightly better against Slime Boss. Spot weakness in the slime boss act is uh sketchy. Pushing chance should be eighty percent right now. No, no sixty percent because I got a vulnerable pot. I forgot about that. I wonder if I need to take sword boomerang. I don't know if I can bring myself to take Sword Boomerang here. Yeah, I don't think I can make myself do that. One rest, one strength upgrade. Corruption's good with both Dark, uh, no, no, no. it's good with both Sneko and Pyramid. Oh damn, it's just lethal. 
Still Chaos is a potion. Twin Strike is a damage card. So is Shrug It Off, arguably. You have to like think pretty hard about that one, but I think arguably Shrug It Off might be a damage card. I would definitely rather put Twin Strike in my deck for Slime Boss than Shrug, and I'd definitely rather have Shrug in my deck for Act 2 than Twin Strike. Tungsten Rod makes Twin Strike even worse because it's not doing anything against birds anymore. And Flame Barrier, I guess. Hmm. What about Havoc? How hard would it be to win a run starting with a random curse every run? Uh, I mean, you sort of already do, right? Sort of what Ascender's Bane does. Is Ascender's Bane a block or a damage card? Could be both. Definitely be both. really want to reshuffle like these are really good cards no bad links for the year let's do this and now dude and see what we had okay i'm gonna split this turn then clearly hopefully that's good enough I don't know. I don't have many damage cards. I do have 42 health. Let's do it like... Um, when we weaken. Guess we'll do it like this. I think it would be hard to die here, but maybe it's not actually impossible. I think now it's actually impossible. All right, cool. This deck, if it gets it all the way to Act 2, uh, which it just did, should be very, very strong. This is Unbroken Promise by Eric Baker. Apparently, I wasn't listening to it. G Bird. Reaper versus Fiendfire. It's a Reaper with two strength and a feed and a spot weakness. I'm going to take Reaper. Yeah, I'm going to take Reaper. Pandas? Pandas seems pretty obvious to me. What if I have two feeds? Look at that! I have a Berserk! And this box is like an, an energy relic. Damn. Uh, I don't think Rupture works very well. I have a Tungsten Rod, so that's probably not a great card. But the other stuff looks okay-ish. Demon Form, Reaper, Feed, GG. Certainly those are cards that uh, do okay together. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they don't do awfully together. I don't really block, so... We'll see how I do at, like, actually successfully feeding. It is the Optimus Prime song. You're right. Paying card reward would be great. Might have to rest a bit. I 
could end the fight this turn. But I have like a Reaper and stuff. And feed. It's better to take three and get my feet off. Another armament seems good. Just need a little bit of chaff that blocks, maybe. Clash got played. This deck's remarkably good at playing Clash. That is a thing this deck uh, does not struggle to achieve. Although it's questionable whether I want to this turn, given that I take an extra 6 damage. We do have two three cost powers we can draw together with Clash. Yeah, but I mean, I'm sure they'd be like happy to see each other. I don't know. Like old friends. Oh, I think I dealt too much damage and now I can't palm all strike. Sure did. Whoops. Sword of Boomerang? Card is very okay. I don't think I take it. Card is definitely very okay, though. Tungsten Rod is a block card. One of my only block cards. With Corruption, I think we just take this. Sentinel, Shockwave, Disarm, Corruption. <laughs> okay. Shockwave, yes. Disarm, yes. That is a boss reward. I am heavily considering going double corruption here. Because I kind of need corruption on play. But Fiendfire is kind of good. And so is Immolate. Nah, I don't think I'm taking Immolate. Fiendfire, though. It's just I can't actually draw a hand of cards yet. That makes Fiendfire kind of bad. What if I skip these? <laughs> what if it's a skip? <laughs> Three rares, no thank you. I'm really close to Juggernaut being incredibly good, but I already have strength, so I guess it doesn't even, like, it's just not enough. What if I let down? All right, double corruption. This is not that bad here because I have a gambling chip. It does get me one card less into my deck, but it's like much, 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 much less bad than usual. 
Also, I don't have like any strikes in my deck, so having one curse is a lot less bad. Sure. A molten egg. Now I can have so many strikes in my deck. I feel like this is actually a fairly poor library. Somehow. I think I'll take Anger. Battle Trance is definitely alright. Maybe I take Battle Trance. Anger seems real good, but maybe I can find one later in Battle Trance. Does Battle Trance things and I have no card draw. Maybe that's better. Alright, cool. We lift again or we upgrade something? Upgrade a feed. No, I think we lift again. Ari stole all the rares. Ari doesn't affect the library there, does it? I don't think it does. What if I kept these? What if I kept Rampage? Kind of weird, like, I don't know, I wanted to kill that and it felt like the Liquid Bronze was a better way to do it than the Exploding Potion. That's why I did what I did. It was definitely kind of weird. Yeah, the Fat Gremlin Thorns interaction got fixed, unfortunately. Thirty-six plus thirty-six plus thirty-seven. Is that exact? Is it one short? No, it can't be one short. That's impossible. Writhe does make clash worse. <laughs> Legitimately impossible. I like have a feed though. I have two feeds though. Mm -hmm. Man, they're upgraded. Something. I think I'm fine here. Book of Stabbing dies to thing, hopefully. You know, thing. Disarm Flame Barrier is what I'm trying to communicate. I don't know. How does Juju stats work? I don't know. Do you not have that answer for you? Oh, 
Okay. Should have this vaguely under control now, maybe. I guess I also have Tungsten Rod. Being a little bit shy, Sundial, Sundial Dropkick. I already have two Pommel Strikes, so I already have an infinite with Sundial without the Dropkick. It does seem like Dropkick would be good with um, Paper Frog and Strength. Maybe. There's a like Ghostly Armor that's not that bad. Old Wolf, thanks for the 26 months! I'm going to take a drop kick because I have a liquid memories. I think Rive is worse than Clash. I think I actually get to play Clash sometimes. No slavers. Disarm goes here, maybe? Hey, Visky! With Writhe gone, I can play Clash, but with Clash gone, I cannot play Writhe. Sure, something like that. So next turn, I get to Spot Weakness and then Full Heal. <laughs> That's gonna be a good turn. Oh shit, it's attacking me. That seems unfair. I do full heal before I get attacked though, but then I get attacked and lose all of my heal. Kinda rude. Wait a second, maybe I have lethal? I should just feed anyway, right? My health is back. I haven't had 20 strength in quite this way as Ironclad for a little while. I think it's Offering over Impervious. They're both good. It only makes me lose 5 health though. Seems awesome. Bottle Tornado is very awkward here because I have two Corruptions, and Corruption is the obvious thing to bottle. <laughs> but I have two of them. Um, what else could I pick? Berserk? No, thank you. I could pick Demon Form. Maybe it's just Demon Form. Let's just pick Demon Form. That's completely fine. You gotta be worried that the other corruption is gonna get jealous. That's important to think about. So much hate for Berserk. That card makes a lot less energy than corruption makes. It also makes you vulnerable. I will play it here, then. I suppose.
Enemy is vulnerable. I am strong and not weak. Have a spot weakness. Good enough. Hey, pain geeks. I'm glad you could catch a stream. Always fun to see people who are getting to watch live for the first time. Sundial is at two, ready to go. I could um, actually upgrade Pommel Strike instead of Demon Farm. I guess I took a drop kick, so. As long as I have Vulnerable on the enemy, it's already dead. Also in this fight in particular, Demon Farm seems like a good upgrade. Starting to sound like a Baba Yuzu phrase, I am strong and not weak. It's true. I try to be anyone. I'll play Berserk this time. Just for all the Berserk fans in the audience. this first in case it's corruption. Uh, okay. Okay. Oh, you can have that, actually. feedback? Do I actually care? I don't know if I actually care. Do I just play this? Get corruption back again? I don't really want corruption back. I can play it immediately. That's kind of cool, actually. This is one of the infinites that goes infinite, and then you're like, haha, I am all oh, the enemies though. I am extremely close to being infinite against this enemy, which has 85 health left. Hmm, is that worth it to play Reaper? I should do this for Sundial. And I can play Reaper, Eat Feet. Yeah, that's a good outcome. I could take Brutality. My card draws a little slow, and I mean, Brutality is just slow card draw, so I guess it doesn't really change that. Nah, I don't think I want it. I could take Barricade. It's kind of weird here, though. I don't think I need another demon form. I'm going to run to the bathroom. I'll be right back.
what did we do to need two battle trances? Battle trances is a good card. There isn't like a huge problem with your draw being a bit slow when you have a hundred health and a tungsten rod. All right. Um, I have to think about a weekend one, maybe. Brutality does not combo with rupture. I'll take a brutality. Pyramid should be very, 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 very good. It's that or nothing, basically. Imagine if you needed cards and then you drew a card that drew you three cards for zero energy. Then you wouldn't need cards as much because you would have just drawn three for zero energy. Pretty cool, right? I don't know if I want double store. I don't have many bad cards. I want to remove rupture. But, like, okay, maybe clash isn't great here, but it's honestly still playable. <laughs> I mean... Also, I can just have dead cards in my deck. How many attacks do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh yeah, this just like draws all of the cards and then it's infinite. Cool. I guess maybe I want to rage. Don't care about drawing another battle trance. You get to draw so many cards when you apply battle chance. So I think generally you don't care very much about drawing another battle chance. Zephyr is here. I don't know why. What do you want, Zephyr? Why are you here, Zephyr? Why do you torment me? Oh, maybe I should have saved armaments to upgrade feed. God, this deck is stupid. <laughs> um, gosh, that was certainly something. It is not a terrible apotheosis at all. It's also not a terrible deep breath. There are two of them. I have a sundial as the thing, so they make energy sometimes. Also, if I draw Apotheosis... Yeah, let's take them. If I draw Apotheosis before them, they also draw two cards instead of one. Dark Embrace Abacus. Ah! Hmm. Okay. That seems allowed to me. I don't know. Instantly got bad when I got pyramid. Oh, that doesn't shuffle the second time because there's no card to shuffle. Whoops. I could wait for armaments. Let's at least wait one turn. Oh, or Apotheosis. Sure. Hmm. 
Evolve doesn't seem necessary. Havoc Plus doesn't seem necessary. I don't think there's anything wrong with Havoc Plus, though. I don't think there's a single card I can hit that's bad. Can I have a Dark Embrace? What could I hit that's bad? I could play Shockwave or Disarm at the wrong time. But it's still fine. Ah, it seems fine. Have a good one, Shazam. Oh, shit. I gained energy. Good thinking to recall might get the opportunity to dig later. Exactly my thinking. Exactly my thinking. Yeah, I can play feet at the wrong time, but I have two of them. I can play Reaper at the wrong time, but like, who cares? Like, this is fine. It's going to die before I get to a point where I'm infinite. That's just how it goes. Actually, how it goes. Uh, I could put Sundial on the right number. I could play Reaper. Ah, oh, yeah, let's do that. Is this one of those runs where the first number on my HP bar is irrelevant? I want this. Sure. Now I have Havoc Protection on Reaper as well. Why not? Um, no, I think it will matter that I have an extra 100 health at the end of the run. Our three potions look like a face. You are not wrong. You are not wrong. is not really a bad hit here. That one's fine. It's not great. Groucho Marx smoking a cigar. It's getting specific. That's sort of unfair. Time to eat the transient. <laughs> Ah, uh, possible. Possible. I 
I would like the apotheosis. Maybe I don't even need it, honestly. Still have Seeing Rod. Send out Prox when I do this. I don't know. <laughs> Did y'all know that I went 8 and 1 in the 10 hours of IAS stream? That's like. That's the thing nobody realizes. Presumably, no one will ever verify that. But I did. <laughs> oh shit. If the daggers weren't alive, that might be better. <laughs> Sharona was a 17 year old that the singer had a crush on. That's like very par for the course for these sorts of songs, I think. Unfortunately. Like, it's a terrible thing, but... I wish I could be more surprised by it than I am, you know? Yeah, but the song kicks ass. <laughs> okay. Alright. Um... I guess that could have given me a curse. It sure doesn't seem like it would matter. I think that it is interesting, perhaps instructive, that we have a bunch of the singers singing about, like, how they want to marry someone who they are currently looking at at a coffee bar, but they haven't even introduced themselves yet. And then those singers end up being, like, sex pests, and, like, we're all, like, surprised. But we, like, listen to the music. Yeah, I don't know. I think that's an interesting one. Who could have seen it coming? Wait, my mind's telling me no, but my body is R. Kelly. Wait, is it really? <laughs> is it really? <laughs> is it really? <laughs> That's not true, right? Um. Hmm.
separating the art from the artist. Yeah. Sometimes it does turn out that they are uh, related things, though, I think. was no way of knowing. But if I was vulnerable, what if I gave you more strength? Eventually something will happen that like causes me to pay for my hubris, surely. I played up my own offering. Want to bash next turn, I guess. Ajorbs, I am Pagliacci. You were Pagliacci the entire time. Time Eater a problem? Probably not. I have a demon form in play. Yeah, that's probably fine. How do y'all like to separate the art from the artist? I like to put them in a jar together for like a week and just let, you know, the different densities of the two things separate them naturally. Use cheesecloth, that's a good way to do it. You like to peel them? Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Um, never mind. I don't want to know anymore. <laughs> to the doorknob and slam the door. <laughs> oh my god. Childhood. I think I'm meant to be upgrading the cards that might be important to upgrade if I don't draw. 
uh, corruption, because I think if I draw corruption, I just win instantly, so who cares? Double the max HP for double feeding on the same enemy? Maybe. The game is just not ready for us. The game just doesn't understand. Fries from a place, and they apparently don't believe in adding salt to their fries or flavor of any kind. So you just got potatoes. Potatoes prepared a certain way. Potatoes are pretty good, though. I don't know. It could be worse. Maybe not much worse. infinite? What turn is this? Two? It is infinite and the enemies are all dead? International Classic Rock Orchestra. Orchestral fix you, yeah. Am I going to eat the heart? Looks like it would sort of be harder not to. Cold play is classic rock. That's fair. That's fair. Maybe I should play Rupture before offering. Definitely possible. It is actually kind of hard to feed here. It's unfortunate. I should have played Battle Trance! I was waiting that entire time to be able to play Battle Trance, and then I just didn't. Oops. Oops. 
Is it cheating to have an electric guitar in your classic rock orchestra? I guess not. Feels like these are the people who make the rules, right? So, if they're doing it. This is the first win that Clash has had in a little while. Way to go, Clash. Every relic is calling bell. Wait, <laughs> do the calling bells also make new calling bells? That sounds really funny. I did it. I played a hundred runs. I ended this above 70% on every character above 80% overall. That's kind of good, I think. I think that's pretty decent. GG. One watcher loss. Yeah. That was the run with two awkward transforms. What should I have for dinner? Logic Dolphin thinks the 10 months. 